as Rotarians, we all understand um, the importance of community service, and most of us have joined Rotary in order to make our communities a better place to live. I think today's celebration is a way for Rotarians in Gravenhurst to show their appreciation for the men and women in our community who go above and beyond to help people in danger uh, who are injured or and to keep our community safe. I've been, I've been with the paramedic service for 50 years. Uh, this award was, was a huge honor to get this kind of recognition. It's, it's a great honor for, for all paramedics to, to have this recognition out there. We, we don't look for recognition, but it's, it's a great honor when we do get, a, get it like this. And, and, and I, I can't say enough about how much it means to me to, to have this. I thank you, Kim and Taryn, for your efforts while working as frontline police officers in the town of Gravenhurst. You certainly made a positive difference in the community and in the lives of many people throughout the course of your duties. It's been great. I've been working in Gravenhurst all of my career. I've been in Bracebridge for 10 years and usually Gravenhurst is my patrol area. So I've made a lot of community connections. I feel like I really know the people. I even recognize some of the faces in the Rotary Club members, which is also great. So it's, it meant a lot today. It's really nice to be recognized. It's, it's the appreciation means a lot to us. It doesn't happen a whole lot. Um, and it was nice to be able to give back to a local charity that means something to us. I've been chosen for the Rotary Award. Uh, it brings a, a lot of uh, good emotion to me right now. Um, you know, being a firefighter for 20 years, a volunteer, um, always looking to help out on any level that you can. And um, it means a lot being recognized by the local service clubs for this award. Thank you very much. And to start off with the first responders, um, getting that program back together, uh, we're just so thrilled about that. And we've had uh, some excellent candidates and we look forward to having more. And so we have started off our in-person indoor meetings with a real bang and uh, now we can get down to the serious work of Rotary and that is helping the community in any which way that we can.